Only you, you yourself and ye, believe to be lizards. Take a moment, grab a breath, just think for a second. How often do you see a person on the street or on your television or perhaps greeting you in a store with a grin that makes you think something along the lines of if that stranger were to suddenly unzip their skin and reveal themselves to be a large bipedal lizard, I would only be momentarily shocked. It's probably not something you ruminate on thinking about. I doubt that you notice the thought flying through your head, the quick and subtle rep recognition of a person's certain reptilian qualities. Next time, try to observe it. Try to catch your instincts and trust them, if only for fun, if only for interest. I don't advise following your grocer back to his home because he cleared his throat and it sounded like a hiss is what I'm saying. Try the fun little experiment of could they be? How are the suits so convincing? Are they aliens or did they come from a weird volcano or something? Just take a look at your looking and all will become clear. Well, most likely it becomes cloudier, but I hate for you not to know or at least believe that your gut isn't gullible. It's a real phenomenon. It truly is. And you wouldn't be agreeing with me right now if it wasn't. You wouldn't be laughing and nodding your heads, thinking back to the last stanza and recalling a time you related. There are lizards all around us on every continent and every country. Likely not in a lot of small towns, but perhaps. Really, if we don't understand their motivation, who am I to guess on where they like to live best? Why are they here? It's not a question that will get answered quickly or easily. <laughs> so perhaps we won't waste time and instead just think, what do these creatures want from us? <laughs> if we've all agreed on the conspiracy theory, if, if the room is with me, um, I must nest ass. It seems like you're not, but I'm going to keep going. Um, it, seems, uh, <laughs> it seems like they want something, doesn't it? And that feeling that you try not to notice was a slight awareness. The awareness that the scaled beast in human suits want something from us, and it's probably not company. And I'm definitely not crazy. I can see you agreeing. Is this it? Not working? <laughs> to say it. No non-profit for undercover reptile awareness, no official holiday for checking if your bank teller has a zipper on their neck, or a color for the cause, though it would be green, or a respectful ribbon, maybe scaly. It just is. Lizard people just are, and sometimes it gets talked about, but mostly we, humanity that is, are good at keeping it under the rug. Mostly we watch the news. Mostly we avoid commenting. Mostly those sharp noses and black eyes don't bug us much. Mostly we are able to ignore it. Mostly we are unable to ask if we should worry, which we probably should, because in the current political climate, I have no reason to doubt the theory that there are lizard people in our relative proximity. Woo! <laughs>